Hey guys, Owen here with Seek Outside. Today we're going to be comparing three of our larger teepee shelters. It's going to be the 8-person teepee, 12-person teepee, and 16-person teepee. So let's get into the pack size right now. All right, so from left to right, we have the 8-person teepee, the 12-person teepee, and then the 16-person teepee. Know that the 16-person teepee can fit into these bags, but it's really going to take up the whole space. So like the 8-person teepee, super easy to compress. The 12-person teepee, there's obviously some more room as well. But then we move to the 16. Um, there's a lot of room in this bag, and obviously there's a lot of air too, but you can compress this down. Like I said, it can fit into one of these bags, just easier to get it into the larger bag. In regards to poles, we have, this is a 16 person pole. The bag is gonna work for the eight and 12 person poles as well. Um, it's not super big. You're looking at about 20 inch sections. Um, so packability, as far as the size of the shelters, which we're gonna set up here in a second, is pretty small for what you get. All right, so we have the tents all set up now. And the first one we're gonna look at is the eight person teepee. So this guy's 195 square feet, eight foot six tall, and weighs in at about seven pounds with the carbon fiber pole and stakes. So this one's still really light, easy to pack on your back and huge shelter. So let's take a look at it. This one's equipped with the door screens. Um, so you can get ventilation. Today's our first really, really nice day here in Colorado. So uh, door screens are pretty nice to have. And I'm just gonna unhook this door here to kind of give you a show. Um, we're using cots for kind of scale here, but two cots and a stove is no problem with this shelter. There's also a ton of standing room here in the middle. As you can see, I'm 6'1", my wingspan can touch side to side. I have room to walk around the tent, sit down. The A-person is a really great shelter for packing on your back and still having a ton of room. So now we're at the 12 person teepee. This guy is nine foot six inches tall, 260 square feet, and it weighs 12 pounds, one ounce. That's with the aluminum pole and all the stakes. This guy also has a door screen. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. And again, we're using our two cots for scale. I'm gonna open uh, this up to kind of give you a good reference but the amount of room going from the eight to 12 is really substantial. Uh, you are gaining about five pounds, but the standing room is just insane. Again, I'm six foot, one inch tall, and I can do laps around here, have a party. It's a really large shelter and super luxurious. You can fit about three cots in here with a stove, which is really amazing. So we are now at the biggest shelter we make, which is the 16 person teepee. Um, this guy is 10 foot six inches tall. So tons of room to walk around 345 square feet. So it's like a small apartment in New York and it weighs 13 pounds, six ounces. Let's take a look again, door screen on this guy. I don't even really need to open this up for you, but I'm going to just to give you kind of a scale for size here. And if you've seen the other tents, the comparison of the two cots in here uh, makes it look super small. Uh, tons of standing room, you know? Like, honestly, I could live in here. You could park a small car in here, make it your garage. Um, four cots, super easy in here with a stove. Um, and for 13 pounds, six ounces, having a four bedroom apartment is pretty good if you ask me. So yeah, this is a 16 person teepee. Pretty hard to beat for its size. As you guys can see, there's a big difference between the eight, 12, and 16 person teepees. From square footage to height and standing room and as many cots as you can fit. I hope this video was informative to you guys. And really the last question I have for you is, which one would you choose? Drop it down in the comments and like and subscribe to this video. Anyways, have a great day.